Hey campers, welcome to another edition of Dutch Oven 101. I'm Roger B. Today we're doing bread in a Dutch oven. I think I'm considered geese challenged. And I, I think I can cook pretty much anything except for bread. Now my bread always turns out tasty, but it's always like a hockey puck. So I've adapted my bread recipe to include refrigerator biscuits. Uh, the spice ones I'm going to use are from a salad shaker, actually something you would use to put on a salad, okay? A little salt, a little pepper. It involves canola oil and a Pepsi can and a Dutch oven. We're going to start off with a Pepsi can. It goes in the middle. Canola oil. I like using canola oil. It's a no-stick cooking spray. It has a little higher flash point, so even in some of the higher temperatures, it's a little more forgiving. Now we're going to take the refrigerator biscuits, we're going to pop them open, and we're going to lay them inside the Dutch oven like a roll of quarters. And we're going to lay it around the periphery of the Dutch oven. And then we're going to take some more and we're going to keep packing them in there. A 14 inch Dutch oven will take about 9 to 10 rolls of refrigerator biscuits. I know, it's, it, it's crazy. Lather, rinse, repeat all the way around the Dutch oven. Looks kind of messy, don't worry about it. We're going to go all the way around and then it's going to come right up against that Pepsi can. Now I'm cooking today in a 14 inch Dutch oven. It's pretty cold outside, so I'm going to use 15 to 18 briquettes on the top. I'm going to use 10 to 12 on the bottom. Uh, I'm going to spin that lid about every 10 minutes in one direction. I'm going to spin the bottom at about every 10 minutes in the other direction, and I'm not going to lift the lid. Remember on Dutch Oven 101, it's all about no peaking. Well, remember I said here on Dutch Oven 101, you always eat with your eyes first. I could serve that bread in the Dutch oven, done it a million times, but why? Find you a big platter like this, put this bread together. Remember we had that Pepsi can in the middle? Pepsi can comes out. I put a little bit of fresh parsley in the middle of this bread, brushed it with some butter, and you've got Dutch oven bread, Roger B style. Hey, I want to put a special shout out to the Utah State Fair Park for letting us use the Zion building uh, for some of the cooking segments while the outside weather was, as they say, crappy. Um, you can rent these buildings here at the Utah State Fair Park. They're very reasonable and they're great people to work with. From Dutch Oven 101 and At Your Leisure, again, I'm Roger B.